hello awesome people thanks for stopping by my youtube channel today we are here to talk about the benefits of eating raw garlic my name is Keslav. this is garlic for those of you who don't know what garlic is it's a tiny or not tiny but uh here it's not so big anyways too but it is very very important herb or spice we use it to cook most of the houses we have it in most food we eat we have them we have garlic in it and stuff and uh, i'm not uh, talking about using it to cook everyday meals and things that is good but i'm talking about eating it raw or taking it on an empty stomach and then in the morning normally i would dice this tiny i'll show a link up there later on for you to check it out and see how i dice it very tiny and then i will put it on a teaspoon and put some honey on it and then yeah i will take it with warm water on an empty stomach some people like to take it in the morning some like to take it in the evening just before they go to bed because a few people that i have told them have used it and some have complained about some stomach cramp or something like that when they take it on an empty stomach in the morning. So those people, sometimes they take it in the night and they don't have the same effect. So this is um, the benefit of using garlic. It's amazing. Um, garlic has a compound in it called allicin and the allicin is very strong and potent. It can fight um infections it fights i know anti a fungal so it's antifungal and it is antiviral and it's also strong and good for people with high blood pressure because if you have high blood pressure it can reduce it and it also detoxifies your blood because um and it can also make your blood thinner also the studies done about garlic is amazing and it's extensive so you don't have to take only my word for it you can look it up it is very very good for you it is also good for people with diabetes if you take the garlic raw garlic in the morning or in an empty stomach and like that it can also increase your insulin level in your body thereby reducing the blood sugar in your system so garlic is very good it also can remove plaques from your arteries and stuff and it can also reduce cholesterol level the bad cholesterol in your body and because it is food when it's attacking anything it will attack the negative or the bad part and leave the good one without having to kill everything on its way so that is what the garlic does and it also is good for it fights against uh, cancer tumors especially in your gut um colon cancer in your esophagus and also in your thyroid cancer and for the thyroid i personally have an uh, experience with it or uh, about two years ago, I was diagnosed with thyroid cancer. And from the time I had my um, biopsy done, the size they told me that the cancer was, though it wasn't very big, but uh, it was still malignant. So it needed to be removed surgically, which I was lucky enough to get done within six weeks or less. And within that time, after the doctor finished, the size had also come down from what they told me before. So I think it is due to me taking this garlic every day before that and be known to me that something was even brewing. So I think all of that helped to make it not as big that maybe it should be or something like that. And to glory to God today, everything is fine but all i'm saying is if you are not taking garlic maybe you should start to look into it and um it is also very good 
for general body aches and things like that and if you have cold and it's good for cold and bronchitis as well anything to do with your chest and everything it's also very good and um especially if you have cold also and you take it dice it tiny like i said and you put some honey on it and you take it it the honey in it also will soothe your throat so if you are coughing it is also very good and the honey also have its own benefits you know it has antiviral benefits also anti-effective also the honey if you get a good one so it is very important you know when you take it you know and i strongly believe that normally if a cold that maybe before it would have last maybe five days or something before you are okay if you are taking garlic it would only last you know maybe a day or two and you are back on your feet again i think it reduces the severity of the normal the flu or the cold that you know you would have gotten without taking the garlic and uh, it is also very good for um people who have um problems with their digestive tract and things like that it's also good so garlic is one of those things that i don't joke with even when i have headache or any of my children complain about headache the go-to will be to go and get garlic and die state and stuff and sometimes my kids especially my younger one will say well then you know maybe the headache is already gone or something like that which is fine because she doesn't want to maybe take it but it is important and also if you cannot take the raw form of it they have a capsule also that it is good you know so you can think about taking it that way and they also can do garlic water and take the garlic water if that works better for you but all i'm just saying is that this small herb or medicine or this small vegetable or wherever it is it is very strong it is potent and it is good to incorporate it in your daily lifestyle and uh, i've read somewhere that if people are having cramps stomach cramps or die i mean menstrual cramps be uh, ladies it can also help to reduce the severity of the cramps and everything so you should think about it and uh that's all i have for us today so please don't joke with garlic it is a lifesaver please do your due diligence look into it and start taking garlic garlic all the way until then have a blast of a day and be a blessing unto others thank you